So your body goes through a lot of changes after you deliver your baby, and a lot of women expect that once the pregnancy is gone that their body is going to shrink back to its normal size, and it does take some time for that to happen. Your uterus is going to take several weeks to shrink down to a normal pre-pregnancy size, so you will notice quite a little bulge in the beginning after you deliver, and that will shrink over time. Some of the advice I got that was really helpful was nine months up and nine months down, and while I don't know that that's a perfect formula, it definitely allowed me to think that this is going to take some time. And one of the things that's been helpful for me is to just think about how to incorporate my children into my own health routine. So resuming activities after a delivery will vary from person to person and from the type of delivery that you had. It's easier for women to bounce back from a vaginal delivery. You're able to kind of get up, get on your feet, walk, move around. For women who've had a cesarean section, you've had major surgery. So the recovery can be a little bit more challenging. But activity is important because you're still at risk of those blood clots forming. So we want to make sure that you're up and about moving around and maintaining good circulation. You do need to listen to your body. You're going to be really tired after you deliver. You're going to have a baby that's up feeding in the middle of the night. And so you may not feel the urge to exercise right away, and that's okay. You can just go for a walk with your baby, and that's great to start with. Additionally, one thing you can really do to help your body heal and get back to normal is try to sleep when you can. Um, you're going to be up a lot, but trying to take a nap when the baby's taking a nap can help your body heal. Um, after delivery and help you get more energy to be able to exercise when you're ready. 